party and the Fallen are bringing in their armory. Again. You'd think they'd know better by now. What's up, peeps? Hope you're having a good day today. I'm having a great day. We're out here playing some Destiny 2. Uh, looks like there's a public event going on right now. But we are going to continue on with the story mode. And we are on Utopia. On Titan. We need to do this one. Um, this is my actual third character. So if you've seen some gameplay already, especially on my stream, it's from me using one of my further along characters. But I want to play and show you the whole story mode for anybody that's not planning on getting the game or who hasn't got it yet and they just want to see a little bit of gameplay. That's what we're doing. Uh, we're going to give away a few of these codes too. Uh, I still have a whole bunch of these Rockstar Energy codes. Um, I think people are starting to get a little, uh, I don't want to say tired of them, but they don't seem to be as necessary. So what I'm going to do is I think I'm just going to put them in the video. You guys can go through the video and find them. It shouldn't be too hard. Um, I'm going to do it until basically I'm out of the code. So if I get more, more will go on to the videos. If, you know, if I run out, then so be it. And I know it's been a while since I've actually uh, put up a video. Oh, this guy's going to kill me, I think. But that's kind of my life. You know, I got a lot of responsibilities outside of just gaming. You know what I mean? So uh, I hope you guys are still enjoying the, the content, though, in the playthrough. Oh, that guy just keeps following me, doesn't he? Shoot him in the face. But anyway, we're, we're trying to get down here to the Red War, and we're trying to continue on with this, this story mission. Um, as far as my other characters go, they're up around like 275 light or something like that. And I'm still waiting to get into even a Nightfall yet. Uh, a lot of my friends that are, that are on here, um, they haven't made it that far yet, I guess. But... We'll have to wait and see. Maybe this next week we'll be able to get into one. So here's the mission. What do we need to do? We need to secure a Golden Age CPU. Yep. Juice like that can only mean one thing. A network of CPUs. Powerful ones. Maybe powerful enough to decrypt that cabal signal we intercepted. Unfortunately, we don't know where the network might be located. So, you're gonna have to snoop around, not draw too much attention. Got it. Securing this asset could turn the tide of this war with the Red Legion. Without it, I don't know what comes next. Okay, so they want us to snoop around without drawing any as all that much attention to us, but, you know, I, I go in guns blazing, so, I mean, we're gonna have some attention. That, that's all there is to it. There we go. I've got a little engram there, a little green one. A little crappy bomb. That's all right. Like the fallen were trying to break through those tiles. <laughs> they couldn't get through, huh? <laughs> all it takes is one little melee. Sounds like the Arcology's operating system is back online. So this looks a lot like Venus, and I don't know. I think that's kind of kind of cool. You know, it, it feels like a little nostalgic uh, flashback to Destiny One when you're running through here. Anyway, let's. Uh, just jump around, jump around, jump, jump, jump up, jump up, and get down, jump around. Um, we're trying to just get through these story missions. I'm gonna go back and do the adventure. There's what is these like little Roombas, kind of cool. Can we kill them? No. Oh, oh, you, you do, yeah, you're doing some damage to them. Yeah, get blown up. Over there. One of the access terminals we're looking for. All right. 
access terminal right here. Welcome to the Pacific Art the Ecology. Is deep in the maintenance levels. Amanda, is this what we're looking for? Bingo! That's the go. Okay, I've got the location. Let's find a way down. Way down isn't going to be too bad. I've noticed a lot of these are the same as Destiny 1, too, where you can actually just run through the majority of the the level. See if you look. I'm not even going to fight these guys. Just run through. Definitely See? in hive territory now. Indeed. Helps you get through the level a little bit quicker. I said this is my third time playing it, so um, not really all that interesting for me. But I'll slow up. I just wanted to show you guys, as an example, what you can do if you're like me and you just want to start a playthrough and get through it as fast as possible. There's some more of these guys. The thrall. The thrall screaming. Man, that really gets on my my nerves a little bit. That high pitch. Yeah. Gets into your ear. Starts giving you a headache. Concentration mode. Trying to get these headshots. I don't even know what my. Oh jeez, that guy's gonna blow up on me. Oh, it's a submachine gun. Not a fan of the sub. Let me know what your guys' favorite gun is so far. Are you more partial to the hand cannon or the scout rifle? Maybe the pulse or the auto? A little sidearm action? A sword? You know, there's, there's plenty of them to choose from. Um, guessing I have. Oh yeah, yeah. player one. Dawn blade. Start throwing stuff at people. Uh, and also let me know if you guys still want me to do these codes. I have no problem doing them. Like I said, I, I've got a whole bunch. It just seems uh, we haven't got many responses on some of the latest giveaways, so I have no problem giving them to the same people either. There's one person that uh, comments and that's during the giveaway, then they're the ones that get it. If they keep doing it, they're the ones that get it. I, it doesn't bother me at all. Alright, festering halls. Let's keep going. Don't want to fall all the way down on this one. Ooh. Surprised that didn't hurt. Well, I guess it did hurt a little bit. Took about half my life away. There's another one you gotta kind of glide into. There we go. More of these napkin-looking cloth things that you gotta knock down. No big deal. So uh, I think my favorite gun so far is the scout rifle. Um, I have. The Mita Multi-Tool. I love the Mita Multi-Tool. Uh, then it would be probably the Pulse Rifle and then a Hand Cannon. But just from the ones that I have right now, um, obviously I think the Exotics are probably better than the Legendaries, which I think they're supposed to be. But the Mita, Mul the Mita Multi-Tool and then the Graviton, whatever it is, the, the Graviton Lance. The Pulse Rifle. Void Pulse Rifle. The exotic one. I, I really like that one too. It kind of throws like a little Nova Bomb out when you get... I don't know if they're kills or just uh, precision kills or what, but... It's pretty cool. But if I had the choice, I would be rocking both of those at the same time, but... You can't do that. You can only have one exotic. That's all right, too. Reminds me of um, Alien. Yeah, where's Sigourney Weaver at when you, you need her, man? Alien setting. 
crawling through the ductwork, waiting for something to jump up from underneath and grab me. Looks like we're coming up to the objective right there, though. Jump down. Whoa. So we just fell from the ceiling. Grab this guy. Alright, let's roll! Whoa. Open up, man. Let me in. We got the CPU, but we stirred up the entire hive colony, and it's a long walk to the surface. Hive are after me. They're not gonna make it out of there, Commander. God, can you make it to the center of the arcology? We should know I can. Give me this tank. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on it. So, um. I'm planning on doing a lot of the gameplay, uh, definitely all of the story mode, but I think some of the adventures I am just going to do myself, off, you know, off camera, um, unless it's something that you guys want to see. Just uh, let me know what you're thinking. I want to kind of get this guy leveled up a little bit more and to try to put everything and capture everything on... Uh, on the first playthrough, it's, it's going to take me a lot longer than what I would like as far as leveling this guy up. So if I can do a little bit off camera, then maybe I can uh, keep him leveled up a little bit quicker. So there's going to come a time... What am I stuck on here? Oh yeah, there's going to come a time when um, the two guys that are pretty much raid ready are going to be out of things to do and if I'm just uploading one video you know, even if it's every day a half hour isn't really that long to put towards one character um, that still leaves a lot of the gameplay to be able to you know to have to do but let me know if you guys want to see everything then maybe I'll do some streams with uh, the newer character but I like to save those for ones that are already established and ones that are a little bit higher up so you can see some of the the, um, the later content, some of the uh, more challenging content. But uh, yeah, let me know, man. I think this is the end of the uh, mission. Let's check it out. Something sitting in front of the sun. That must be that almighty that they're talking about. They call it the almighty. Crown jewel of the Red Legion and life's work of their leader, Dominus Gaul. Gaul has subjugated hundreds of worlds. Those that resisted no longer exist. You see, the Almighty annihilates stars. Nothing and no one survives Gaul's ambition. What he wants is the Traveler and its light. As for the Almighty, it's now pointed at our sun. In short, sir, the war's over and we've lost. Dun, dun, dun.
All right. Well, this is where we're going to end it. Well, we got a little bit of cutscene here. I guess we're going to watch this quick. We built our home under the protection of the Traveler. When our enemies attacked, we built a wall that stood for centuries. But now walls mean nothing. This enemy has taken our home, taken our light, and now they threaten our very existence. We're going all in on this almighty. How long before the fleet's combat ready? Zavala, wait. If we wait, we die. But if we attack together, we can take back our home, our light, our hope. Or we die trying. Now, I need my fire team. I need Ikora and Kaid. Looks like we're going to be getting the fire team back together, but uh, that'll have to be for the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed your time with me today. And if you did, make sure you leave that thumbs up. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Love you all. Have a good one. Later.